Warning, the following video is very awkward and very cringy. If your pain tolerance is not high, I do not recommend watching this video. I don't know what made me do this, but by the time I realized what I was doing, I was already too far in. And Funimation, if you're looking for someone to hire, my email is always open. But anyways, here, just play the video. Red. The same color as her hair. Darker than any red hair I've ever seen. Just like the color running down my hand. Long, beautiful crimson hair. Just like this. Not today. I will not let you die. One, two, one, two. That was the plan anyway, but here we are up against the spring semester of our second year, and between the three of us, we don't even have one girlfriend. What's the point? It'll never happen. No, we can't give up. It's not too late for us. Woo! Kiba, wait up! What are you doing right now? Yeah, do you want to maybe go sing karaoke with us? Thanks, but I got a meeting with my club. Aw, that sucks. I really do wish I could go, though. It was very cool of you ladies to invite me. Kiba Yuto, class 2C. Basically, every girl in the school wants to sex him up, and every guy wants to mess him up. That tool? I don't get it. Just because he's hot, sexy, really smart, and the coolest guy in school, they want to rub up on Kiba? He sucks so much less than we do. Oh, snap! I'm gonna be late! Huh? Gonna be late for what? <laughs> I still think attacking me with bamboo swords was a little extreme. Did you at least get to see some nip? No, I didn't get to see any nip. I was too busy getting my ass handed to me for looking through a tit hole that I didn't get to look through because of you a-holes. <gasps> Did you guys see that hoodie? Her sugar has got to be sweet. True that. What is it about red hair? Her name's Rias Grimry. 36, 24, 36. She's the president of the Occult Research Club. Word around the school is she's from Northern Europe. Who was that boy? <laughs> what boy? The kid who was sitting in the middle. Well, I think he's in class 2B. If I remember right, his name is Issei Hyoto. Why? What makes you ask about him? Oh, nothing. I was just wondering if you knew who it was. That's all. Oh, checkmate. Aww. Your trap was very easy to see through. Sorry, I did my best to make it harder on you. Thanks. I look forward to next time. Ugh. Being a teenager is the worst. At this rate, beating it to porn is the closest I'll ever get to doing it before I go off to college. Which means I'll be a virgin forever and die alone. Excuse me, you're Issei Hyoto from Kuo Academy, right? Or am I wrong? Huh? Yeah? I don't recognize that uniform. What school is she from? Who cares? She's fine! Hi, uh... Hey, if there's anything I can help you with... Sort of. I just wanted to ask you a question. Are you seeing anyone right now? Now? No. That's wonderful. It is? Uh, in that case, since you're single, do you think you'd like to go out with me? Go out? Um, I... I've been watching you. You pass by here a lot and you seem so... I don't know. Gentle. And very handsome and I... This cannot be happening to me right now. See, the thing is... I'd like for you to be my boyfriend! Whoa! Whoa! Is this for real?! No! Please, God! What?! Guys, this is Yuma Amano, my girlfriend. And these are my buds, Matsuda and Murahama. It's nice to meet you. And here's the best part, dudes. She asked me. Hey, stop whacking it and you'll find one too. Come on, let's go, Yuma. Okay. Dude, he portrayed us. <laughs> go out? Yeah, 
Next Sunday afternoon, can you do it? Sure, that sounds great. I can do it anytime you want. It's a date then. Night. Yeah, you too. I really am happy you're my boyfriend. Ditto. Bye bye. Yeah. A date! A date! This is badass! I'm so gonna see Lady Parts! I am the man! I sure had fun today. Yeah, best date ever. Dude, I think this is my chance to make a move. I'm touching her. Can I ask you a question? In honor of our first date, there's something I'd like you to do to commemorate this special moment. Boom, 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 I'm going to get to kiss boom, her. Boom, I'm totally boom, going to get to kiss her. This rocks! Sure, you can ask me anything at all. Mmm. Would you die for me? I can't do this. Huh? <laughs> What'd you say? Sorry, I think something must be wrong with my ears. I don't think I heard you correctly. Could you maybe say that one more time for me, please? <laughs> I want you to die for me. <laughs> Whoa, breasticles. Those are boobs. I'm looking at boobs. My little boy eyes have finally grown into manhood. And she's a super hot chick, too. What's that old saying? This is a sight for sore eyes? This is totally a sight for... Wait, no it's not. She looks like a demon. Are those wings? Well, I have to admit, I did have some fun today. Considering how naive and childish you are, things could have gone much worse. Thanks a lot for the gift, too. Very sweet, but even so... You Yuma, wait! Please! It's time to die! I'm sorry, but the fact is you were far too great a risk to us. I had no choice but to dispose of you. If you're looking for someone to blame, why not blame him? He gave you the sacred gear. What in the hell is she talking about? Oh, thanks again for the lovely date! It was fun. What a... Am I really going to die like this? Alone and pathetic? And a giant virgin? If you were going to kill me, couldn't you have let me squeeze your jiggly jugs first? I only got to look at them for a second, but I could see how bouncy they were. Oh, Yuma. Red. The same color as her hair. Darker than any other red hair I've ever seen. Just like the color running down my hand. Long, beautiful, crimson hair. Just like this. Wait, why the crap am I talking like this? I'm about to freaking die. It's over. Damn. I can't even move anymore. Trying to touch a pair of orbs. What a stupid way for a person to die. <laughs> to be honest, I know I've lived a shadow life. Next time around, I'm gonna try real hard to be a better person. The only thing I can think about right now is Rhea's. With her pretty red hair and huge gazongas. If I'm gonna die, then why can't I do it motorboating those glorious fun bags? I have come. You are the one who summoned me, are you not? Who is that? Since death is upon you, I will gladly take you in. Whoa, she has wings too. From this moment forward, you will live your life for my sake. Let's go ahead and clap that one up. Yeah! Woo! 
I know, I know. It's time for me to answer the question you all had. No, I'm not the voice actor for any of these characters. I know, I know. I put on a very convincing performance. But, uh, yeah, I don't know why I made this video. I was just in my room. It was, like, late at, like, 3 a.m. That's where I get most of my video ideas at, like, 3 a.m. And I saw this one video on TikTok. This one right here. I bet your mother will be proud of you. And that video made me start singing the OSTs from High School DxD for some reason. And then that turned into me somehow trying to say the lines in High School DxD, going through the script and everything. And then I got up and I was like, you know what? I'm gonna record the first scene in High School DxD and see how this goes. It went so well that I just decided to make a whole video on it. This is probably the most awkward video I've ever made, but it's also the most fun I've ever had making a video. But yeah, next week I should be back to normal videos but don't be surprised if i come back with another scene because i kind of want to do the kiva scene but i'm gonna get out of here if you enjoyed the video please like and subscribe and uh thanks for watching